Hi, I'm Deb Bossinger from the Leesburg Public Library. I am the program coordinator here, and we are going to give you some updates on what's happening at the library. First up, for the month of May, we are running Food for Fines. This program allows you to waive a dollar off your overdue fines at the library for each food item or a pet item that you bring in and donate to the Leesburg Food Bank. If you don't have any fines, any overdue fines, good job, but you can donate that amount anonymously, anonymously to a family or a person who does have overdue fines. It's a win-win situation. We are able to donate hundreds of pounds to Leesburg Food Bank every year. Next, let's hear from Courtney about what's going on in the youth department. Thanks, Deb. All right, I'm gonna tell you everything that's going on in youth and one of the biggest things that we're doing coming up is our summer library program. This year we are doing Tales in Tales, that's T-A-I-L-S. We're going to be having a lot of fun animal adventures and one of the biggest things we're doing with that is Page Turner Adventures. They are returning with us this summer for another eight week long virtual adventure. They will be having something new every weekday, Monday through Friday. You can get access to Page Turner Adventures through our Facebook page. We will be putting the link out every day and you will need some login information for that and we will be putting that out through flyers and on our Facebook page as we get closer to summer. That will be from June 7th to August 2nd. The other really big thing we're doing this summer for our summer library program is prize drawings. We are, will be having several prizes to give away and you can win those just by using your library card. You come into the library, check some stuff out, and your name gets entered into one of our three prize drawings. And we'll have a new prize every week. And you can put your name in every day just by using your library card. We also have our virtual escape rooms. We've been putting our virtual escape rooms out for the past year. We have over a dozen already available. You can access those through our Facebook page, but we have a new one coming out this summer on June 22nd, and it is Sunken Voyage. You can play that anytime this summer, and if you complete any escape room, you can receive a library escape room brag tag. We will be continuing a lot of our virtual programming, including Family Crafters, Teen Toad, and Storytime Online, but we also have a new virtual program called Picasso To Go. This is in partnership with the school, Create Conservatory, and they are STEAM integrated projects. We have STEAM kits that you can pick up here at the library, and then a short art lesson will be available on our Facebook page. We also have two in-person programs that will be going on this summer. We have our Reader of the Pack, that is every Thursday from two to four, where you can come in and read to our Paws Therapy Dogs. We will also be starting our Game On program where teens ages 13 to 18 can come into the library and play on our P PlayStation 4 and Nintendo Switch. That will be every Wednesday starting June 9th from two to four. And that is everything that is going on in the youth department this summer. Deb, I give it back to you. Thanks, Courtney. And adults, about the summer reading program, I want you to know that you're going to be able to enjoy too. Every week, look at our Facebook page. You'll look at your email that you receive on Saturdays to find out the adventures that you'll be going on. We recently wrapped up our One Book, One Community program where we gave over 900 books of the book Home Sweet Motel to third and fourth graders in the community, in the Leesburg area. Many schools were involved and the Orlando Sentinel was our partner on providing the books free to the community for a read, a community read. The One Book, One Community program is important because it fosters literacy skills and a shared reading experience for all ages in our community. That we still do have the book available for borrowing through the library and that it's the first book in a series of three. So if you enjoyed the book, please make sure to ask us for the next two books. We have them here for you. When you finish reading your book, make sure to come into the library and receive your brag tag. For more information about events that are happening at the library, please see our calendar at leesburgflorida.gov library. 
Also, one great way to know what's happening here is to receive our weekly e-newsletter. It comes out on Saturday mornings. If you're not already receiving that and would like to, send your request to librarian at leesburgflorida.gov. Thank you for joining us today. We look forward to seeing you at the library.